Hello, welcome fellow traders, AMP Futures here, presenting another how-to video. In today's idea, we're going to demonstrate the new available chart type that TradingView has recently rolled out called the Session Volume Profile. Now, the Session Volume Profile, also known as SVP, what it's going to do, it's going to calculate volume data within a specified session or subsession, which is going to allow traders to analyze the intraday volume activity of one specific part of the session. Now you can select the new chart type from the drop down menu on the top panel of the chart, just like you normally would for any different chart types that you normally have access to. So right now we're looking at the exchange traded futures contract, micro S and P 500. We're looking at a candlestick chart at this very moment on a 30 minute time frame. If I click the chart type icon in my chart toolbar here, notice now you can see session volume profile is now available as one of the new options. And you can see there's a little new tag kind of giving an indication that this is a new chart type that you can use within trading view. So I'm going to go ahead and select it to apply it onto the chart. And the first thing that you're going to notice is the chart is going to show volume histograms for the specified sessions and subsessions, as I just mentioned, or time interval set and the settings themselves. So you can actually change the parameters and styles of the chart in the chart settings menu in the symbol tab. And to make things even easier, TradingView has actually set these settings in, as they present them in groups. So let me explain what that means. So if we right click on the chart, and we go to settings within the context menu. Here's the symbol category group under chart settings, which is where you're going to make the majority of your changes for the volume profile session. So now you can go into the volume profile section specifically, where you can enable the display of values on a histogram column, for example, or adjust the width of the area for columns, as well as the colors of the histogram. Now, if you go to the different group right below it, which is the lines group here, then the line section, you can activate lines such as PLC, uh, VAH, you know, you have VAL, as well as uh, developing POC and also developing VA. So these are all personal preference as far as settings that you want to use. And you can also modify those settings by changing out the colors. You can thicken up the weight, things of that nature. And then you also have the ability to set up sessions in the input section. So if you scroll down just a tad bit more, scroll down here, you see the input section here. And this is where you're going to be able to set up the sessions in the input sections where, let's say, for example, like volume, line placement, and level size will be displayed. So once you make these changes, you're going to get in there, choose whatever specific group of settings you want to change. Once you make those changes, simply click OK, and then you'll be well on your way as far as using the new chart type called the Session Volume Profile using the TradingView platform. And this is how you access the new chart type that TradingView has recently rolled out called Session Volume Profile.